so let's say you have the uh, following block diagram which would be G feedback with H and of course this is a negative feedback and let's say that uh, G is 1 over S times S plus 1 times S plus 2 and let's say that H is 1 as it normally is so let's say that uh, you wanted to plot the uh, or you wanted to make a transfer function variable in MATLAB so the transfer function is the output over the input in this case the output I named it C the input is R and I'm gonna call that my transfer function T so let's take a look at the MATLAB code that is required to get that function so I'll go ahead and open MATLAB go to file new script so this is where I'm gonna write my MATLAB script the first thing you wanna do is you wanna clear all the uh, variables that might be saved in the workspace and that way they won't affect your uh, new variables that we're gonna make here you also want to clear the screen you know just in case you've been working on MATLAB and you have all these numbers uh, shown in the command line here so go ahead and clear the screen with the command CLC since we're gonna be using a variable called S we're gonna need to make a symbolic for that variable now the next step is to uh, identify the numerator and the denominator of both G and H so let's make a variable for the numerator of G called G num and of course that's one now let's make a variable for the denominator let's call that G den now since this is a uh, polynomial and we're going to be changing from symbolic to polynomial you type the function sin to poly which basically just means symbolic to polynomial and inside of the function inside of its parentheses you just type the expression so that's my numerator this is my denominator so G is going to be my uh, numerator over the denominator and to do that you type TF which stands for transfer function and then you uh, pass it the numerator you put a comma and then you pass it the denominator so with this line here we have made our transfer function variable G now let's go ahead and make H So H is simply one, so we don't even need to make a variable for the numerator for the numerator or denominator. It's simply one. So go ahead and save this code and let's run it to see what we have so far. You can name it whatever you want. So now that we saved it and I named it transfer functions, let's go ahead and run it. and if you uh, open the MATLAB command back up again you're gonna see the, uh, the the transfer function was made so this is G and this is H and if you will type G again and hit enter so you can see what value it has once again because when you run that code it doesn't tell you that it's G but you know if you just type G and hit enter it'll show it to you and similarly for H let's go back to the script so now that we have the functions G and H we have to uh, close the loop in a negative feedback so our 
final transfer function T which is the output over the input is going to be the uh, feedback of G with H and close the parentheses now in your block diagram the uh, function that is at the top always goes first in this, in this feedback function the one below goes second now you might say well I'm never I'm not, I'm not saying here that it's a negative feedback and the reason for that is that the function feedback assumes that it's always negative feedback if you want positive feedback you will put a comma here and a plus one so let's go ahead and run this code to see the uh, final result so once again just click the uh, play icon so this is my final transfer function t so now let's go ahead and plot the uh, step response of the function so just type step t run the code once again so this is my step response plot and uh, if you want to see characteristics like percent overshoot and all that just right click characteristics peak response so now go ahead and click on the dot that appears and you're gonna see the overshoot here is 14.5 percent TP which is the time of the peak 6.13 you can also get the settling time rise time and of course the uh, steady state so that's how you make and plot uh, the response of transfer functions in MATLAB